sana naman yung mga barangays ulit at yung mga cities uh, makakapasok na rin sa awards next year. So to all the governors, the mayors, the winners, yung mga program officers ninyo, our sincere congratulations. We'd like to thank all those who participated in this year's awards, our sponsors, our board of uh, trustees, our national selection committee, uh, the Department of Local Government and uh, Interior, LGA, Local Government Academy, uh, all those who continue to make the Galing Puok Awards possible on a year-to-year -year basis. Maraming salamit po. Magandang hapon. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Coscuruela. May we request His Excellency, President Benigno S. Aquino III, to lead the awarding ceremony. May we also request Mr. Rafael Coscuruela, DILG Secretary Jesse Robredo, Ms. Maria Nieves Confessor, Chairperson of the Galing Pook Foundation, Ms. Hilda Pico, President and CEO of the Land Bank of the Philippines, Ms. Crescent Shana Bundok, Senior Vice President of the Development Bank of the Philippines, and Doc Ed uh, Dorotan, Executive Director of Galing Pook Foundation to assist the President. Now, the 10 outstanding lo local government governance programs. We now proceed to the conferment of the award to the 10 outstanding local governance programs of the 2011 Galing Pook Awards. Each winner will receive a Galing Pook marker for the program and a plaque for the local chief executive, if he can carry it out of this hall. The winners will be called in alphabetical order. We now call on Governor Edgar Chato to lead the province of Bohol in receiving the award for their program the Bohol Rabies Prevention and Elimination Project. <laughs> Alarmed by the high incidence of rabies in the province, the provincial government embarked on a rabies elimination program in 2007, which focused on responsible pet ownership, dog registration and vaccination, establishment of bite centers, and inclusion of rabies information in the school curriculum. The incidence of rabies has since been reduced and there has been no report of death from human rabies since 2008. Delay. We now call on Mayor Leoncio Evasco Jr and his delegation to accept the award for the municipality of Maribohok, Bohol for the LGU-led cadastral survey simultaneous systematic adjudication project. By actively leading to the conduct of a cadastral survey in partnership with the DENR Penro, the municipality has already distributed more than 800 titles to landowners thereby addressing boundary disputes and land grabbing issues. In addition, real property tax collection increased. Mga kababayan, ang ating pong uh, minamahal na Pangulo, His Excellency President Benigno S. Aquino III. Good afternoon, please sit down. Secretary Jess Bredo, Mr. Davis Confessor, Governor Rafael Cosculuela, Dr. Eddie Dorotan, other members of the cabinet present, Ms. and Ms. Gilda Pico, Ms. Crescentia Bundok, finalists and awardees of the Galimpo 2011, members of the Galimpo National Selection Committee, representatives from the local government units, Doc national governmental organizations, international organizations present, fellow workers in government, honored guests, ladies and gentlemen, of course, I have to greet my boss, Ernie Garilao. He was my first boss. He <laughs> gave me a lot of the skills that I'm now employing the service of the country. Sa loob naman ng ilang taon, naging talamak po ang rabies sa buhol. 
Subalit so, dahil sa mahigpit na pagpapatupad ng kanilang rabies prevention and elimination project sa tulong mismo ng mga boholano sa matagumpay na pakikisa sa pribadong sektor at sa liderato ni Governor Edgardo Chato na nauna yata sa amin sa Kongreso, ay natuldukan nila ang nakamamatay na sakit na ito. Samantala, matagal ng problema ng mga taga-maribuhok-bohol ang wastong pagtitulo ng lupa. Ngunit dahil sa aktibong partisipasyon ng buong pamayanan, kasama na si Mayor Leoncio Evasco Jr., matagumpay nilang naipangalan at naisyo ang mga titulo ng lupa sa mga tunay at karapat-dapat na nagmamayari nito.